It's my very first box swap. Ah! Hi Disney friends, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, I'm Kel. So you may have noticed that I'm not in my typical filming place with the holidays. It's been hectic. I usually film in my office slash hobby room and it has not been quiet in the house. So I'm actually set up in my daughter's bedroom today. The only place I kind of not have craziness around me and just a white wall. I have my very first YouTube box swap and it's not just any box swap. It's not just one where different YouTubers are sending each other gifts and which are great, but this is my type of box swap. I love to spend money, but save money, if that makes sense to you. I love getting a really amazing deal. So Jen over at Life Joyfully Done has been doing this box swap for a while now. So what happens is it's a competition. What's better than a competition, right? So we all were assigned a different YouTuber. We all had a $50 budget, but the goal of this box swap is to have the largest percentage of savings. So everyone got about $50 spent on them. You could be $5 over or $5 under. But the idea was to have the largest value in the box for $50. So I have my box here. Based on the return label, I'm pretty sure I know who this is from, but I'm gonna make sure that's right. Um, we'll see that in a minute. So I already pre-cut the box and I am dying to open it. This is a preference swap. So through a chat, we were able to exchange our likes, our dislikes, collections we're planning on growing, items we'd like to avoid. So the person went out and tried to buy items, not only that were a good deal, but also that the person receiving their box would hopefully enjoy. So I like pins, you know that. So collections I want to grow, definitely pins. Don't really care which pins, my favorites are ones related to parks, parks attractions, and villains and Mr. Toad. The other thing I shared was that I don't really care what form it is in. I really just want to grow my Mr. Toad collection. Like, I think I might be starting a very unhealthy relationship with my love for him. So, you know. <laughs> so I'm hoping to at least get one Mr. Toad item in the box. And if it's not, it that's fine too, but that's my hope for the box, but whatever's in here, I'm sure it'll be wonderful. I am ready to dig in. I am ready to see what is in this box. Let's do it, Disney friends. So the box is decorated on the outside. Based on the return label, I already told you I'm pretty sure I know who it's from. Let's see what's in it. On the inside, first of all, presented with the most beautiful color. That is absolutely my favorite color of purple, that deep eggplant purple. Love it, and a card on top. Christmas wishes. Oh, how, we'll come to this in a second. How cute. It says, Dear Kelly, I enjoyed having you for my bargain battle swap. I enjoyed watching your channel and I know I didn't win the contest. However, I really enjoyed the bargain I picked up for you. This is who I thought it was. Kelly over at Magical Disney Pals and then her son Brayden as well. Funny, we were just watching your channel last night. <laughs> oh, so sweet. Thank you, Kelly and Brayden. I don't care what's in here. I know I'm going to love it. In here, spoiler alert, just like in any of those other boxes that you can have curated for you. There's going to be a spoiler where it shows what the price was originally, what was actually paid, and then we will see what the percentage of savings were. Let's dig into it. Okay, first of all, too cute. 
<laughs> this is like a genuine shock and surprise because I was expecting to lift up that purple paper and it was just going to be all of the items. I was going to pull one out at a time and show them to you. But Kelly and Brayton individually wrapped each and every one. So it's almost like I have a little Christmas treat here waiting for me. Oh, I'm a feeler. If you watch my channel, you know I'm a feeler, but I also do it on my gifts and I love to try to figure out what they are. I think I know what this is. I know what this is. I know what it is, I think, but I'm hoping I know who is on it. If this is what I think it is, this is the one thing I want in my gift box, my swap box, and I would had a whole theory behind it. Let's see. I should have saved this for last. Okay. I should have saved this for last. I had a whole theory behind this and I think it worked out. Okay. Are you ready for it? Are you ready for his intense handsomeness? Oh, oh my goodness. Tell me he's not adorable. Tell me you don't love him. Do you see him? Sitting right there. Look him as looking as handsome as can be. I know you see him. So I had a whole theory on this that I saw Jen at Life Joyfully Done pick up this hat at Burlington and I contacted her and said, hey, if you still have that, let me know. I would love to buy it off of you because I haven't been able to find it, my Burlington. And she's like, no, I already you know, gave it to someone else or sold it to someone else. And I thought, hmm, I wonder, and I'm gonna ask her, I wonder, did she give it to the person who had me in the box swap because I was dying hoping that this would be in my box and this I don't care what else is in there I hope I love everything this is what I want it in my box <laughs> ah love it oh oh there's only one more huge thing in here oh gosh I don't even think I can try to figure out what this is Maybe a blanket? I don't know, let's find out. <gasps> Get out of here! I don't even know what to say, Kelly. Like, don't even know what to say. Wait until you see this. Do you remember what I said I wanted to see most in my box? I said Mr. Toad, and then I said villains. This is one of my favorite villains. And my favorite color. Are you for real? Are you for real? Never in a minute did I think I would be getting a lounge fly. Like, never. I've got to look in here. Ah! To say I'm speechless is beyond words like, Oh my God, you're gonna make me cry. This is so nice, Kelly. Oh my goodness, look at this. Oh my God, I love those eyelashes. Oh, and on the back, we have the cronk. Devil and angel, oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. And this is something I would never buy for myself, never. Just, 
it just wouldn't happen. So I have like two, two lounge flies that I have. One I got as a gift and one I bought at a steep discount at the character warehouse. It's just not something I buy for myself. And my husband often says like, just get it, you know, you, you'll want it, you'll love it, just get it. And it's just not something I buy for myself. So let's take a look at the inside. Oh, there's something in here. <laughs> I was not expecting something to be inside the bag. It's the llama poison potion. Look at the print. Oh, and it has a pocket on the inside, which is awesome. Oh my God, Kelly, you nailed it. I love it so much, so much. I was thinking that was it. I can't imagine how else you were able to put something else on the inside, but Let's go to the inside. Feels like a mug. Feels like a mug. It's purple. Oh, I've seen this and this is again something I've wanted. I actually thought about buying it for my husband so I know he's going to love it as well. It is the Haunted, it's the Haunted Mansion, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's the Haunted Mansion uh, blueprint from Disneyland. This is my husband's very favorite ride. Truth is, he'll probably drink out of it most. He loves to drink out of regular coffee mugs every single day. So I do drink. Oh, I didn't realize the Disney D was right there. That's super cool. And he loves a big grip on the mug so he can hold it. He is going to love this. I love it too. I know he's going to use it way more than me. That is amazing. I have really no words for how stunned I am, how taken back I am by this experience. I want to thank Jen and everyone who participated for letting me be part of this battle bargain box swap. It was an amazing experience. I had so much fun. I love the challenge. And I hope the person I sent my box to also loves their box, hopefully. Um, I didn't do as well as Kelly did, by no means. I did not do this well. So hopefully she likes it. So let's do the spoiler alert. So on here, we had to fill out a spreadsheet with the original prices of the item the price that we paid and the percentage saved overall. So let's see what great deal she got. Ooh. So she put a little note down on the bottom that says, I know I definitely didn't win the bargain battle. However, I thought you would really enjoy these items much more. I love your channel and your pin collections are great. Happy holidays, Kelly. Brayden over at Magical Disney Pals. I did love each and every one of them. So thank you so much. Now, I am a little bit confused. So let's start first with the Yzma Lounge Fly. So this was originally $75. She paid $49.90 and saved $25.10. That's awesome. That is a great discount. I don't know how you, maybe it was just on sale. I haven't been able to do a great job finding Loungefly with coupons or anything like that. So let me know how you did that. And then the Mr. Toad's hat, originally $27.99. The tag says $4.99. Great savings, right? So a savings of $23 and a total spent of $48. So so I am a little confused because this mug wasn't listed on the spoiler alert. So I don't know if it was just like an extra here, I think you'll like it. Or if it was left off on accident, I don't know. I, 
I love it either way. In this bargain battle box swap, there are a bunch of different channels competing and I will link all of those down below. Make sure you check out all of those channels and then also watch the live on December 4th to see who actually wins this battle. So who ended up having the greatest amount of savings in the box that they created. So a little PS to this video. After I film, I go out and I show my husband what was in the box and I come out with the hat on and he's looking at me like, and he walks away without saying a word and he goes and gets the mail. He rips open a package and bam, this was going to be one of my Christmas gifts. Now, the interesting thing is the one I got from Kelly and Braden is the Disneyland's Mr. Toad. And the one he got me was the Disney World's Mr. Toad. So they're not the same. Thanks for stopping by, Disney friends.